My name is Brian Hallett and I'm the usher of the Black Rod. The Black Rod is actually a stick, first created in 1927 when the what is now the old Parliament House was opened. Um, it sits in a glass case in my office when, it's, when we're not sitting um, and then on sitting days I take it out of its glass case, I give it a polish um, and I carry it with me in my right hand as I bring the President in. It then sits um, in a bracket at my seat in the chamber and stays there for the rest of the day until the Senate adjourns uh, or when the Senate finishes for the night. If I'm doing anything in my official capacity as Usher of the Black Rod, uh, for example taking a message to the House of Representatives, I take the stick with me because the stick is a symbol of my authority. The Deputy of Her Excellency the Governor-General requires your presence in the Senate chamber. It's a role with two sides, if you like. There's the side working here in the chamber with the president and with senators, and there's the behind-the-scenes role. Well, when the Senate is sitting, um, there's a particular uh, order to the day, if you like. Um, I go into the president's office with the black rod, which is my um, stick of office, if you like, um, and I'd bring the president into the chamber here, and I announce the president. Honourable senators, the president. We then say prayers, and uh, we acknowledge country. Um, and then the Senate gets down to business. And then I might perform one of two roles. Um, I either might continue in my black rod role, where I have a responsibility for keeping order in the chamber, um, or I might work as a clerk at the table. And being, working as a clerk at the table basically means that we're keeping the minutes of the meeting uh, and helping senators with advice as to the order of business. And I also have another role um, looking after the, all the corporate affairs, the management of the Department of the Senate. So I make sure that every senator uh, has an office, that in that office they have computers that work, the lights work and all those sorts of things. Um, I also make sure that senators get paid and I have responsibilities for making sure that the Department of the Senate, uh, which supports senators in their work, uh, can operate as well. So that staff in the department are paid, um, that the staff have workplaces, um, that our budgets are balanced and that we meet all our reporting requirements. The usher doesn't wear a uniform currently. Um, I just wear a, a simple suit, as I'm wearing today. Um, in the past, um, some chamber staff, including the usher of the Black Rod, uh, have worn a uniform. There were buckled shoes, uh, there were breeches, there were stockings, there were black gloves. Uh, if you were a military person, you wore your medals. Um, and there was this wonderful uh, lace ruff or tie. But that was dispensed within the 1990s um, and I suppose it shows that Parliament and the Senate in particular um, can adapt and keep changing. There are many challenges in this job. Um, obviously serving 76 senators you have to be equitable and you have to treat all senators equally irrespective of whether they're in government or opposition or whatever party they come from. Um, and you have to make sure that um, you are being as fair and even-handed as possible. A lot of things have to be done to, to very tight time frames. Um, if um, a senator needs a piece of advice or there's an issue with something in their office, it needs to be fixed and it needs to be fixed right now. But having said that, while that's a challenge, um, there's also a great sense of achievement when um, you do get these, these things completed uh, to the satisfaction of senators and within the required time frames. Mm -hmm.